suspected super tank Russian battlefield killer was shot down by a Ukrainian UAV. Photos posted on social networks show a destroyed Russian T-90M tank in Ukraine. Photos on social media show that a modern Russian main battle tank T-90M was destroyed in Ukraine by anti-tank mines and Ukrainian unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs. According to the site mil.in.ua, the chain of this tank was broken, leading to inability to move after being hit by an anti-tank mine of the Ukrainian army. Then, at night, Ukraine's UAVs poured a rain of RKG-3 anti-tank grenades on the ill-fated tank, causing it to explode and burst into flames. Images obtained after the attack showed that the tank's turret had been blown away by the force of the explosion. The exact location and timing of the raid have not yet been announced. The Russian Defense Ministry has not yet commented on the information. Developed by the Ural's Transport Engineering Design Bureau, the T-90M Pro Reef is a powerful improved version of the Russian Army's main T-90 tank. This tank uses a powerful diesel engine that allows it to travel at speeds up to 72 km per hour. The T-90M tank is equipped with a 125mm caliber cannon that can fire powerful ammunition and missiles capable of destroying enemy tanks at a distance of up to 5 km. The new multi-channel observation system allows the tank to use its armament at any time of the day. In addition, the ability to exchange data with other combat vehicles in real time is one of the main advantages of the T-90 Ampro Reef tank, earning it the nickname Invincible. In addition, the Nikitka coating has the ability to absorb radar waves, allowing this tank to easily camouflage on the battlefield. Advanced explosive reactive armor layers called Relict and Shtor IM defense system also help protect the T-90M effectively against enemy guided anti-tank missiles. Earlier, sources at the scene confirmed that Moscow had sent 50 T-90 tanks to the Sawadaway area in Donbass, where fierce fighting between Russia and Ukraine is taking place. According to analysts, this means that Russia is trying to put all its efforts to quickly control this strategically important area, in order to create certain advantages over Ukraine when the new year 2023 is approaching. Adjacent, 